Okay, Don, welcome back. You said you didn't have a particular topic on, on the thing, so I said, let's talk about something about money. Now, most people have stuff around money. That's really, really normal. So um, I don't know what your particular issue is, but most of us have one. What would you say is your sort of weak spot when it comes to money? Saving it. Saving it, okay. <laughs> so do you find you tend to make it and then spend it? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So uh, it's, it's some sort of, I just saw your fingers moving, so take your hands up. Sometimes it's like money falls through our fingers. Mm. Yeah, that makes sense. So as opposed to saving it. Okay, how would that be to save money? How does that feel? What could you build with that pot. pot of money? What would that pot of money build over time? What would that get you or your loved ones? Time. Okay, time. Essentially time. Oh, don't drop it. <laughs> Keep it firm. Okay. What else? Repairs, okay, so it's going to do some repairs in the house. Well, anything else? Travel, okay, you could save some money and then do like a big trip or yoga trip or whatever you fancied, <laughs> yeah? Okay, great, now relax. So what happens to you when you start thinking about saving money? It doesn't feel natural, I guess. Yeah. I mean, I tried to do it, but just seemed to put it in that I've got and it gets taken out. Okay, so who does that? Me. <laughs> okay, so the first thing we need to do is like, please take responsibility for it. This is, again, very normal, so no judgment at all for me on this, right? This is a hard subject. This is one of the advanced subjects, I would say, yeah? I always say that, like, you know, people think that sex is a taboo, but money is a bigger taboo, you know? So say the word money out loud, if you wouldn't mind. Money? What do you notice in your body when you say that? My toes came off the ground. Okay, so your toes came off the ground. <laughs> Now do a kind of nice Scaravelli mountain pose. So you're kind of solid, grounded, knees slightly bent. Yeah, and they'll say money. Money. Okay, anything happened there? No, that was better. Bit better, wasn't it? Let's do it two or three more times. We're reconditioning you, does that make sense? Like you've got a certain conditioning to be nervous around money or whatever that was, some sort of stress response, right? So now you're using this pose, you're using all, the good thing teaching yoga teachers is so fucking easy because you've got loads of practice already, yeah? So two or three more times. Money. And really say it out loud, like money. Money. Take the hands out, money. money. And now do this, money. So money. you got that solid pose still. One more time, money. Money. Yeah, money. 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 A little bit of tension in your face, relaxing that. Watch the feet. Money. Money. How's that? <laughs> How's that? It looks way more joyful. How does it feel? Yeah, it does feel better. Start to feel better, right? This is again a little practice you could take away. Cozy. Cozy. Cozy's nice. Cozy's nice. Okay, relax that. Let's, let's look at this. It's already great work, by the way. Really quick, really great work. Um, questions? So it's putting that in, into the body. Mm -hmm. Does that help you to, whenever I think about saving now? Yeah, so say saving again. Saving. What happened? <laughs> I okay, so find that mountain pose again okay. and breathe. Do all that yoga stuff you know really well. So I'm going to actually try and do this pose and then put some money in my savings. Okay, great. <laughs> yeah, great. That laugh sometimes might be a sign of nervousness, oh, yeah. okay? So relaxing the body, relaxing the feet. Oh, do you imagine putting that money into your savings account? I'm not sure how you do that electronically. Yeah? yeah? Physically. Physically, okay, you put it in there. Keep breathing. Saving money. Savings. 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 You can imagine putting that money in the savings account. Savings. It makes me feel safe and cosy. You feel safe and cosy. Okay, great. Yeah, it can feel good, huh? Yeah, yeah it can feel nice. Mm -hmm. A bit of money to the side. Sure, it can help, help us a little bit with the unpredictability yeah. of life, yeah? Okay, great. And let's look at this from another angle. Put your arms down a minute. You've done really well already. We could stop there. That's a great practice. So you're reconditioning your bodily response to money. So it's not money, ah, okay, ah, okay. Actually, what do you do? Do you drop it? Do you give it away? What normally happens? Yeah, I give it away. Or... I enjoy it. I enjoy, enjoy it, it. Uh -huh. I, 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 mm -hmm. I guess, What I... would you be if you saved money? What's your like biggest fear here? What, would, <laughs> what are you saying? Oh, that nightmare voice, you'd be what if you saved money? Like boring or like um, a sting, like what would you be, like what's the fear there? Um, I don't think there's not really much fear around it, but 
maybe it's from my less, I don't have enough drive to, to earn enough money to save. Uh, okay, so, so this is a different like issue. Yeah. Yeah, 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 so yeah, 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 yeah. It'd be good if I pushed myself a bit more, maybe. Okay. But then in other ways, Do you I'm quite happy having the time, so it's balanced time and money, isn't it? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I always say, I, I never tell people what to do, I always say it's awareness and choice, so it's you know, becoming aware of some of that anxiety around money, which is I can definitely see in your body. So you might want to help yourself, you know, money, recondition that, yeah? Now as to how much you want to earn in terms of do you want to have the relaxed time or do you want to push yourself more, that's your choice. Okay, but it's a clean choice that you make. Thank you very much, Tom. Thank you, Mark. You're welcome. So I like working with yoga people or dance people or people that have an embodied practice. You saw this with Ben and his jiu-jitsu because they, they have a lot more body awareness so they're able to learn quicker. It's the same as anyone else, really. It's just a bit quicker. Uh, and then they, they also get the idea of practice and practicing something, doing the repetitions. So uh, nearly always bringing